Hi guys and welcome back to my channel or if you are new here then hello my name is Kate. So in today's video I've got a spring haul for you guys showing some bits I've picked up from Mango, H&M and Zara. It is finally March so we can definitely start thinking about spring fashion now which is very exciting. It always feels so fresh and so clean after the winter and wearing lots and lots of layers and coats and heavy things. So yeah I'll show you what I picked up and as always everything will be linked down below. So I'm going to start off with this leather jacket I picked up from H&M and I just really love leather jackets in the spring because you can wear them over a really feminine and light outfit and then throw this over the top to immediately just make it look so much cooler and edgier and of course they are very practical as well because they're not too hot not too cold and fairly waterproof as well so this is a faux leather and it's really lovely and soft um, it's that buttery kind of material. Buttery is like my favourite word at the moment. I'm using it to describe everything. But yeah, it feels really nice and it looks like real leather, but it isn't. All of the silver hardware, it's got a couple of pockets. It also did come with a belt that I have taken off. I think it actually fell off, which is kind of frustrating that they don't have any way to secure it in. So I'm not 100% sure if I'm keeping this or not. Just because it would be nice if the belt was attached, because I do think when they have these belts around the bottom, it is a nice feature and just adds a little bit more detail to the jacket. Apart from that, I do think it is really good value for money. This was £50 um, and I picked this one up in a size medium because I like my leather jackets to be nice and oversized. In the try on clip I styled this for the weather right now which is kind of still a bit cold but I feel like in the summer this over a really nice white dress will look so beautiful paired with some chunky black bike boots as well. And I also did really like the fit of this. I like how it's fairly long um, I find that a lot of jackets at the moment are cropped and I definitely prefer the oversized look. I also picked up the jeans that I'm currently wearing from H&M which were styled with the leather jacket in the last clip. I'm wearing them right now, they are so comfortable. I really wanted a pair of very light and light in colour and also lightweight jeans for the spring summer and these are so perfect, they are exactly what I was looking for. They are this really beautiful pale blue colour which is so perfect for the spring summer. The majority of my jeans are in that kind of mid wash or a dark wash and the ones I have in a lighter wash are that slightly heavier material. So yeah, I picked up these hoping that they'd be what I wanted and they are perfect. I always forget how good H&M jeans are because they're not really my go-to place for jeans. I go to H&M more for kind of like tops and jackets and coats and these are the second pair of H&M jeans I have got and yeah, I can't fault them. They fit so so nice around the waist. They're very high waisted as well. I always like it when mum jeans are that little bit extra high waisted, just so you can really kind of cinch them into your waist. And I just find that they are very flattering that way. I also do really like the way they are shaped, kind of like almost like a triangle. So they go quite wide and then slim down towards the end, which is that classic mum jean style. But you do sometimes get those jeans that are just straight all the way down. And yeah, I said it in videos before, but I do really like it when they do come in a little bit tighter at the ankle. Again, I just think it's quite flattering. And yeah. They just feel so comfortable. I feel really confident in them, which is very important with jeans. I feel like these jeans are just going to get so much use and you're probably going to see these all over my Instagram. And I went through to size of these and went for a six. Another item I picked up from H&M is this little cardigan here. And I'm quite shocked at myself because it is obviously a bright colour. And I tend to really stick to monochromes and neutrals because that's where I'm happiest. But I thought I'd mix it up a little bit for spring and get something that felt very seasonal. I'm not 100% convinced, but nonetheless, I do think it's a really beautiful, cute, and a very seasonal cardigan. I always see Hailey Bieber styling cute little kind of cropped cardigans like this with some jeans, and she just looks so cool. Um, so I thought I'd do a little Hailey Bieber moment and try copy her. This cardigan was super affordable, but the quality seems really good. To be honest, I love all H&M knits. I always find the quality is perfect. It's got three cute little baby blue buttons going down, and then these slightly raised elevator sleeves, which are always very on trend, and give it that slightly more expensive feel. Whether or not I'm gonna keep this, I'm not sure. If you see it on my Instagram, you'll know that I've kept it. But yeah, I just don't know if it's very me. Let me know what you guys think. Do you think it's me? Do you think this will work? Or should I just stick to what I know, which is monochromes and neutrals? I picked this one up in a size small, and I wouldn't go up or down a size because it is supposed to kind of have that quite dainty and elegant light look. The next item I picked up is the ultimate spring basic which is the plain white linen style cotton shirt. If you're looking to build a capsule wardrobe or want a really great staple that can be worn again and again and again, these are the best. Shirts are a bit of a tricky one because they have to have that perfect balance of smart to casual, not too office-y, got to have a good flow to them. And I feel like this one does have that perfect balance. I really like the way it feels ever so slightly linen-y but with the cotton look. Although I love linen shirts, personally I would wear them more on a summer's day or 
kind of on holiday whereas this one just feels a bit more kind of england weather appropriate it's super plain i really like the way it has no pocket um i think in my last h number haul i picked up a very similar shirt but i picked it up in like an extra large and it was huge and i haven't actually ended up wearing it as much as i'd like so yeah i picked up this one which is slightly different and it is a bit smaller i got this one in a size 12 and this is only 9.99 which is so affordable for a basic that you are going to get so much wear out of. I can think of so many ways to style this, but this is just some leather leggings and some loafers and a leather jacket. Throwing over the top is a really kind of laid back classic look, or you could pair a jumper over the top of this um, and wear it with some jeans and that would be very cute and slightly preppy. Or you could throw like a knitted vest over the top of this and that would look really cute as well. Now moving on to the bits I got from Zara. I'll start off with my favourites, which are these two trousers here. I got them in two different colours and I'm definitely going to be buying them in more colours. So they are these beautiful tailored trousers, which I loved the look on online and just loved them so much more when I tried them on. I just love the tailoring on these trousers. As you can see, they have these gorgeous kind of seams and darts going down the front, um, hidden pockets, and they are just a like really tailored straight leg all the way down. And these just fit so well. They are very snug around the waist, which I love. I got these in a size extra small. These are a tiny bit too long for me though, but you can either pin tuck them and that actually looks very cute, or I might just get them tailored. I'll see sort of how I get on with them. Um, but yeah, I've already worn these a couple of times and they are brilliant. So flattering. I actually popped a picture up of these on my Instagram yesterday. I'll pop a picture up on the screen. And I got lots of messages from other girls saying they have these and they are just obsessed. I actually think these would make a really good office work trouser because they are nice and tailored, but they still have that really flattering feminine feel to them to make you feel really confident. I think this is my favourite colour because it's just so summery and spring-like. It's this really beautiful cream. It's quite a cool cream, there's no yellow tones in it and they just look so expensive to me. I think these are a great wardrobe staple. Even in the winter you can style this up with some knits. You can wear them all year round, not just in the spring. This with like a black knit and some black loafers I think would look really good. And I also picked them up in this gorgeous camel colour. It's quite a, again, quite a cool toned camel. It's more of a browny colour um, but this with like a white crisp shirt or a white t-shirt would just look so nice. Um, I think I shot in these the other day as well. Yeah, I did. Um, again, I'll pop a picture up on the screen. But yeah, I actually paired it with a sweater and some trainers just to give it a bit more of a casual feel. And like I said before, that is a look I really like, kind of mixing smarter elements with more casual elements to create to create a really well-balanced outfit. I'm definitely going to be picking these up in some more colours. I really want the black. I don't know if they had white, but if they do, I'll definitely be getting my hands on them. The next thing I picked up from Zara is this gorgeous wrap blouse shirt kind of number. When I saw this, it just instantly gave me holiday vibes and maybe I'm being a bit hopeful but I just think this would look so nice on a holiday. It has a really kind of textured linen-y material to it which which is very kind of summery so maybe I am thinking a bit ahead but I did just love this. And it has this kind of like almost slightly like tied knot effect in the middle where it does crop in and then the sleeves have this shirt button vibe to them. I just pictured this with like a white lace bodysuit underneath and some white shorts or some white jeans in the summer. This was actually a little bit more expensive this was £50 but there's something about it that does feel a little bit more luxury and a bit more high end. The fabric just sits really nicely. This is like a white lace bralette underneath and then some like wide leg linen trousers would just look so good abroad. Maybe a pair of some brown sandals as well. But for now and for England, I think it would also look really cute with some black mum jeans or some black leather jeans. And I picked this one up in a size extra small. So if the lights change slightly, it's because I've just gone and got a parcel from downstairs. And I quickly opened it and I actually really want to show you what I picked up because there are some really nice spring pieces pieces in this, this parcel and I think you guys are going to love them. First one being this gorgeous shirt here which I am obsessed with. From what I can see on camera it looks very blue but it's white and blue pinstripes and I just think this is so perfect for this season. I can just picture this with some skinny black jeans and some loafers. Really rolled up sleeves, very kind of laid back and casual. Or in the summer, you could even wear this with some white skinny jeans and that would look amazing. Um, so this is actually from New Look, who, as you guys know, are one of my favourite brands. It has quite big puffy sleeves at the shoulders, as you can see, there is this ruching here. I got this in a size 10 to size up, but it is actually already fairly oversized. And yeah, I don't have anything like this in my wardrobe, so I'm very excited to style this up ready for spring. It's that really classic, slightly like dad shirt, boyfriend shirt kind of look, which I am obsessed with. 
These have also just arrived from Look, and I just think these are amazing. I mentioned in my last video how I think loafers are very in the spring summer, um, especially like the Prada chunky vibe ones. But I wasn't a massive fan of the chunkiness of them on me. And then I found these ones on New Look, and they kind of have that Prada vibe without the chunkiness and like the heaviness to them. They're actually very slim and very flattering on me as well. And I actually love them these were only 25.99 such a bargain and you just get that really expensive look i love how shiny they are they also have a little bit of gold detailing here at the back which is going to be perfect for tying in all of my other gold accessories and then the last bit from new look is this cardigan and like i said i'm very inspired by hayley beaver's cardigan styles at the moment and this was perfect for what i wanted to create this is so so soft it feels really good quality i love the big chunky buttons going down and it's just a really gorgeous creamy oat color um my plan of this is to start with some black mum jeans and maybe those loafers or some like mid wash jeans and some little strappy heels or something like that i think that will look so cute but yeah i just think this is to die for i absolutely love it and i picked this one up in a size medium for that slightly oversized look you could even wear it just off the shoulder slightly and yeah i just think it's so cute and it's thick enough as well to wear it on its own without a coat in the current weather and then finally onto mango i only picked up two pieces from mango but i actually am obsessed with them both i think they're so cute and very good for spring as well the first one is this beautiful blouse and i just think this is stunning it's got all of this kind of elasticated ruching on the front these big balloon puffy sleeves like look how big these are and um, which then elasticate at the wrist and it's made out of this kind of like crinkly textured material but it is still very soft and this is just that perfect blouse you want for the spring summer i think this would look amazing with some mum shorts i think this would look amazing with jeans with skinny black trousers trousers um, there's just so many ways you can style this and it just gives me so much kind of feminine pretty vibes i really love tops like this just because you can wear them even with just leggings on a day working from home and it just immediately makes any outfit feel a little bit more dressy and like you've kind of made a bit of an effort so i actually got this one in sale for 20 pounds which is insane i think it was originally 30 pounds um, and I got this in a size small. And then the final thing I've got to show you guys are these shorts here, which I actually featured in my last spring styling video. I am just obsessed with these. I think these are the perfect leather short. Again, they're that really soft, buttery, the word I love, material. And the quality of them is just amazing. I really love how tailored they are as well with the seams going down the front, which just makes them feel that bit more smart and day-to-day -day rather than kind of like a night out kind of thing. I really love how tailored these are and they have the belt loops as well so you can easily pair a belt with them. They're also a really great length. They're not too short. They're definitely a really good everyday short. In the trial clip, I styled these up with some tights just because it isn't quite warm enough weather for bare legs just yet. But come the summer, you could definitely wear these without anything underneath i wore these out the other day and i actually styled them with like a big knitted jumper and that was a really cool look again balancing the kind of more spring summer with winter um for that perfect transitional look and i just know that i'm going to get so much wear out of these this summer they are such a classic a great staple to have in your wardrobe and if you're like me and you're not a massive fan of wearing skirts i personally just feel so much more comfortable wearing shorts as opposed to skirts just because there's a lot less risk in you flashing people and they're just really easy so yeah i think these are one of my favorite pieces in the haul i picked these ones up in a size six and they're very true to size i wouldn't go up or down so yeah that is everything in my haul it was obviously quite short and sweet but i just really wanted to get my spring wardrobe kick-started and get some new pieces into my wardrobe to inspire me a bit for the coming season please do let me know what you liked and if you bought anything i'm always very interested to know if you have any comments as always just leave them down below and i'll get back to you i hope you'll have a lovely rest of the week and i'll see you in my next video bye